Hey everybody, Mental Fox here. Welcome back to Fallout 76. Okay, uh, so this is where the game decided to put me. Um, I was kind of expecting to be a bit closer to Pleasant Valley Ski Resort. Um, yeah, and I'm kind of a little concerned also because we had already infiltrated Pleasant Valley Ski Resort in the last episode. And I thought that we had made it to a new quest where um, I was supposed to like look for some something from some Brody guy. And we found Brody's room and we went and found his computer. And I thought that the latest quest was to... Uh, uh, I don't remember what. Find something else but related to that Brody guy. But... Um, Okay, now it says search for information about the Order of Mysteries. Okay, so that looks like that's changed now. Uh, okay. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know where this place is. Uh, nope, look. So, huh, it, it looks to me like the game is acting like I haven't done any of this stuff. So freaking annoying, man. It, there's so many problems with this game. It's it's a shame. Because I, like, I do like playing the game. I like exploring I like the little bits of story that we find um, but pff, there's so many bugs man I mean you saw how much trouble I had uh, getting into um, the ski resort in the last episode you know there's some some guy had to come in and basically save my bacon I was just lucky that he was there no freaking way I'd be able to survive this place uh, if somebody hadn't cleared it out for me already I'm going to walk over here and just kind of see what the place looks like. See how how bad it is. Um, are there players here? Hmm. No, I don't see any players running around. But I hear a lot of gunfire. Uh, here's something down here. This is a recipe for infused blood leaf tea. I think I've already got that. Let's see if I've already got that. Uh, it's not a hollow ding dong. It's over here. Recipe. Yeah. I've already got that. <laughs> Several times over. Ooh. Um, something I'm looking for is right up here. Um, I'm trying to be sneaky. See if I could just kind of hop up here and get what I came here for. Without too many people seeing me. Whoa, what is going on over there? Something I'm looking for right here. And there are enemies walking around in here. Oh, it even says caution. Can I not climb over this? Okay. Uh, Lewisburg ambush. I think oh, I already read this one. We read this one. You hear about the ambush down in Lewisburg? Another one of those girls. They had the drop on her, and she still managed to take out half of Carrie's crew before they brought her down. Got the old man himself, too. He still owed me for poker last week. I think there are any caps last left in his stash. We see we already read this. And um, when I was here last time, I was attacked by those digger things <clears throat> but uh, you can hear there are there's somebody walking around it sounds like um yep super oh he saw me crap find you oh crap um uh, oh gosh there's a ton of them too well i mean you saw how much trouble i had with these things last time um where are you I mean, if they stay this level, I'll be okay. I'm wondering if, like, what happened last time was that, you know, that guy who ran in, the one that ended up saving my bacon, he was such a high level, um, that when he came running in, the enemies scaled with him. I don't know if that's true or not. So, maybe... If these guys stay level 5 and 10... to take him out myself. Look at that guy over here. 
Holy hell, there's a lot of them. Uh, do, am I out of health? I should press the button, man. I'm telling you. Controls are terrible. Yeah, if these guys stay these, this level, I might be able to take them out myself. I didn't get him. There's so many of them. Uh, okay. Oh, gosh. I, uh, so many of my hits don't register. You know, I'm, I'm hitting him. You know, my crosshairs are right on his head. But uh, so many of my shots don't do any damage. Oh, great. A grenade. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. Molotov landed right in front of me there. Oh, jeez. There. Jerk. Go away. Somebody behind me? Oh. Oh, oh gosh. They're down there. Gotta get rid of him. So, oh, apparently I leveled up. Leveled up again. I mean, that's a good thing about taking on all these enemies. You know, it's a good way to level up. I I'm telling you, I'm pressing the button to switch to the freaking shotgun. And it's not it registering. I mentioned this before. I don't know whether the game is trying to talk to the server and there's a delay or what, but I press the button to switch weapons and it just does not register. It's very frustrating. Very frustrating. Um, but I think there's a lot of them here, but if, if they stay the level that they're at, I should be able to take them out. It may take me a little bit of time, but I should be able to do it. And then we could go back in here and start searching for clues again. Like we were doing in the last episode. I would like to be able to do that. Still dudes walking around. Oh, hi. What's up? Okay, trying to switch weapons again. Oh, hi. That was nice of you to wait. trouble here still dudes shooting from somewhere these raider corpses that I've already looted take the grenade here's another note Harvey's deal we read this one last time I'm gonna read it again because I don't remember it yo you freaked out about all those mysterious assassins slinking around in the shadows afraid your crew was going to be hit next your old pal Harvey has just the thing Missile launcher to the face. One shot from my little beauty, and all that's left of that girl will be a smoking crater. I'm looking for a new gig. Double cut of the loot, and I'm yours. Hit me up if you want to talk, Harvey. Okay, so there's still trouble up here. Still a dude walking around. Oh, there's a safe down here. Uh, and here's Geraldine's uh, Fitzsimmons holotape. We listened to that in the last episode also. Uh, but I missed this uh, safe. So let's go and unlock it and see if there's anything cool inside of it. Oh, yeah. Bunch of stuff in there. Got some purified water. Here is a recipe for tasty stingwing stew. That does not sound familiar. Nope, but I already knew that one too. Okay, well. Cooking stove. Do I have anything uh, worth cooking? I don't know. I'm still wearing that ski outfit. <laughs> uh, no, I don't have anything. That's nice. Here's a note here I don't think I met, read last time. Jake's note. Snake, you sure you don't want in? Hawk said those girls never hit the same checkpoint twice. That makes North safer than wherever it is they have you these days. Think on it, all right? Okay. Not sure what to make of that. We're looking for something up there. I see you. Oh, nice. Nice sneak attack there. That was pretty freaking cool, man.
Get some uh, music playing in here. You know how I feel about that. See if I can find a way to get in here. Um, ever look on this bus? Man, there is uh, water all over this place. Kinds of good stuff. Where is this thing? Oh, it's right here. <laughs> no, there's a code piece. Who cares? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a code piece. Not going to do me any good. Alright, where's this music coming from? Um, don't know. Stairs going up there. Huh. Well, I guess maybe that's just part of the carpet. I thought there was a marker on the on the ground, but it's just the carpet. Somebody built some steps here. Shut up, music. Shut up. Thank you. It's this guy we took out. Here's another note here. Tony's orders. Pretty sure we saw this one last time. Tony, Brody said his girl came through. He has the tape. Head over to his room and start digging. If this really is what he claims it is, we can finally put an end to this order of mysteries. Thorpe. <laughs> Nothing in there. Oh, here's a bobblehead. Sneak. Uh, when used, you were 30% harder to detect for an hour. Okay. That could be useful. Oh, why did I pick that up? I don't need that. So, I think what I'm looking for now is a Tony's room. Or Brody or whatever. See, there's water all over this freaking place, man. It's pretty cool. And I think it's... Uh, down here in this other building? Whoa, there's like an arena there or something. And it looks like there's some power armor in there. Yes, indeed. That's, that's Brody's room right there. Let's see how I get in this place. I mean, obviously there's a way in. I made it in there last time. Uh, here is Holden Mc McMerrick's holotape. We also listened to that last time. So here is... Uh, what? Look at this. I can't get in there. Huh. I was able to get in there last time. Now let's see if there's another way in. Hey, what's up, guys? Who's mama, mama roach? Baby roaches. Hmm. Well. I need to get in that room. I didn't come all this way to not be able to get in. Um. Some shooting going on. Is there another player around here? I don't see one. There's a super mutant skirmisher around here, too. What an interesting design. Um, let's see if I can get into Brody's room from the, uh, the balcony. Uh, it's in uh, this direction, right down here. Yep, this is it. <laughs> well, hopefully this door isn't locked. Okay, good. It's locked, but I can get into it. I speculated that maybe that was Brody there when we were here last time. Well, we can get in this way. 
Pretty sure I already unlocked that footlocker when I was in here last time. So, um, what does the quest say now? In order to become a mistress of mystery, I need to learn how the raiders knew so much about the Order of Mysteries. A note mentioned that a raider named Brody had a holotape with information about the Order in his room. I need to find it. <laughs> Optional, find a password for Brody's terminal. So there's the terminal right there. And I can't get in, so we are going to have to find the password. I'll be dug on. <laughs> Apparently it's going to be in this footlocker. Don't ask me how I know that. But my character seems to know that somehow. But uh, luckily I can. I have the skills to get in here. And I have the bobby pins to get in here. Oh, okay, this was in here last time. Pleasant Valley Intranet Memo. Okay, this is when he's talking about uh, the passwords. Yeah, I know the intranet's on the fritz again. I'm on it. If we ever find the bastard who installed this cut-rate piece of shit, I'll throttle him with his own coax. I'm probably going to have to wipe the damn user logs again. If you get locked out of your terminal, come see me in the main lodge for a password reset. Until then, if you need to talk to someone, get off your ass and go find them. So I need to go to the main lodge now which is somewhere up there so huh. let's see if I can't get up there maybe go around this way so yeah there's like an arena down there look at all the bodies Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Now well, that's the end of that. Raider corpse. The frag grenade. Gunpowder. Shotgun shells. Frag grenades. And some power armor there. But I'm not really interested in it. This is weird. This raider corpse just standing here like this. Well, thank you for the grenades, dude. <laughs> Look at their symbol. It's got skis and ski poles on it. That's funny to me. But yeah, I'm... <clears throat> just not interested in uh, power armor. I probably should be, but... I just prefer the freedom of running around without it. I like being faster. Um, and all these guys have the same stuff on them. Oh, typewriter. I want to take the stealth boy. Still hear some uh, super mutants walking around here. But I need to go around here somehow. Okay, this is... Oh, there's a bench here. So many barbed walking cane mods. Here are... Oh, here's a plan for a portable toilet. I think I have that already. Scrappity scrap. Okay, scrap... Uh, whatever. How many times have I scrapped junk to produce aluminum? Many, many, many times. I'm not wearing this, so we'll go ahead and... Uh, recycle that. Uh, do I need to repair anything I'm using? Yeah, my sniper rifle needed repair, so it's a good thing that I remembered to do that. Still more super mutants walking around. I think I want to go this way. Somewhere up here. Hope I'm not doubling back accidentally. 
Okay, whatever I'm looking for is in here. Hmm. Robot walking around in here. It's a pretty neat place. Pretty big. So something, something walking around in there. I'm gonna have to assume that it's gonna be trouble. Oh, look at this, mole miner, rock breaker. Huh? Who took these guys out? Were these super mutants and the mole miners fighting with each other? Maybe. Whoa! How cool looking is that? <laughs> that is neat. I was not expecting that. Exportable fuel tanks. Have something I'm interested in. Hmm. A sack full of duct tape. Oh, we got a banjo here. Oh, war drum. I don't think I played this. Oh. It's a weapon. I thought it was an instrument. Here's a guitar sword. So now I have a uh, war drum. Let's see how this thing compares to my uh, guitar sword. Uh, I'm gonna pick my guitar sword. Compared to the, well, I can't do anything with the war drum. It does a lot of damage, but it'll be a long, long, long time before I could do anything with that. All right, let's start by pressing the right buttons here. Cutthroat crag. What, what, hey, whoa, right now. Oh, this guy's coming to fight. Oh, I see the robot now. Muffled yelling. Level 22 guy. Oh, he's coming. He's a coming. Oh, Jesus, this guy's hit hard. Something just blew up, I don't know what. Oh, jeez. Oh, man, this guy. Oh, jeez. Uh, okay, I can zoom out now, please. Oh, gosh, this game. Sometimes you... Most of the time, you have to hold down the right mouse button in order to zoom in. And then you let go of the mouse button, it zooms out. But sometimes... It just stays zoomed in. I don't know why. It just does. I don't know if that suit scrap is worth anything or not. See this robot in here. Is he a bad guy? He probably is. He's not. Vendorbot Resin. Those guys crack me up the way they come running at me. Oh, hey, what's up? Whoa. 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 Okay. No, 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 no. Zoom out. Gosh. Hey, what's up? Ouch. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, let's... Okay, reload. Reload, please. Okay, take your time. Oh, he hit me. Oh, okay. Uh, missiles... I don't need a missile launcher. Mine suit breather. Alright. Well, that was messy. Not my best work. Blue garden gnome. Oh, wow, look at this. A uh, ski pole. Take that. So, the ski poles. Am I over encumbered? Yeah. What do I need to drop? Let me eat some food. Some heavy food. Um, oh, I got I got two stealth boys. I don't need two stealth boys. Uh, I'll eat the mutant town chops. They're kind of heavy. And then I'm thirsty. So we'll have... Um, a new cola. Chem box. Sure, why not? Let's unlock this thing.
All right. Miner's key. Hmm. A miscellaneous open the miner's locker in Hornwright testing site number two. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. We get these ski poles. Trading posts. Turn this off. Okay, let's go in here. <laughs> uh, pack of duct tape. Wonder glue. Oh. I can't get in this way. Another pack of duct tape. Dirty water. Another stealth boy. A lot of stealth boys around here. Oh, gotta ring the bell. I demand satisfaction. Oh gosh, can't get through there. Okay. Hmm. Alright. This is kind of a weird way to get in here. Let's try going up. Wooden ski. Who skis on wooden skis anymore? Okay, let's see if I could go down. Trading post. Oh, let's see if I get the pie. Nope. No pie for you. Let's see. Bunch of skiing outfits. Another ski sword. Crushed yellow canister. Oh, hello. How are you? Uh, ski poles. I'm going to take these because I want to scrap them for the whatever this inside of them that I want. What's up, vendor bot? Got some scary raiding gear. But maybe you're looking to buy an upgrade or do. There's another robot walking around in here somewhere. Um. So. Do I have a weapon I want to sell him? I don't think so. I should have put this in my, my stash. I don't need to be walking around with this thing. Um, yeah, I don't really think I want to sell him anything. What I really want is, um, uh, a bench. There's different bears here. Uh, resort manager's terminal. Uh, manager's terminal, no unauthorized personnel. Intro resort mail 11076. Uh, to Carl Beltran, facilities coordinator, from Karen uh, Gerard, operations manager. Carl, we've had a terribly mild winter, so I was wondering if you could consider running the snowmakers overnight for the next three weeks. Guests at the resort have been complaining that the powder just isn't ideal for skiing, and we don't want them heading home thinking about going someplace else next time. I realize this will put a strain on the units, but we must do everything we can to make our de guests feel like they're at the premier resort for Appalachia. 328. To Sarah Siegfried, public relations from Karen Gerard, operations manager. I got your mail, Sarah. Believe me, I am well aware that the slopes we have at Pleasant Valley are not exactly Olympics caliber, but we must make do with what we have. That's why I would like to get some input into changing Trail C into something more exciting. That trail certainly isn't challenging, but I think if we upscale the marketing on it, we can give the impression that it's dangerous. I was toying around with ideas and I came up with Cutthroat Crag. 
Do you think you could mock up a flyer pushing this new idea and go over it with me tomorrow? Uh, 819. To Carl from Karen. Did you switch on the snowmakers or did we have a freak blizzard last night? The entire area is covered in fresh powder, which is unusual. Well, almost impossible for this time of year. Either way, the timing couldn't be better. We have a VIP guest who just rented out the entire facility to take advantage of the fresh snow. I'm going to need you to get on the phone and get everyone in here right away. We don't need to be up and running in... Oh, we need to be up and running in two days. I know that doesn't leave your team with much time, but do the best you can and I'll see that everyone gets a bonus. 11.30.76 to Sarah from Karen. As I'm sure you're aware, the Pheasants on the Run event had mixed results. I'm not sure how you talked me into this event, but having guests ski down shenanigan trying to hunt pheasant was not only ridiculous, but dangerous. That being said, we did have the highest attendance in ski rental sales on Thanksgiving in the last several years. Oh, and before I forget, could you please send a get well soon bou bouquet to the poor guest that accidentally wiped out when her ski caught one of the five pounders? Thanks. Okay. Two eighteen seventy seven. To Carl from Karen. I'm only going to say this once, so you might want to print out this mail and take it to your wall. I rode the lifts this morning and was absolutely appalled at their condition. Not only were they noisy and vibrated terribly, but they were filthy as well. I found empty champagne bottles shoved between the seats and on my car, and some rich spoiled brat carved his initials into the plastic. This is unacceptable. You and your team have a week to get the lifts back into peak condition, or you'll be hunting for a job somewhere else. You, you tell him, Karen. Um, is that it? Is all that was in here? Yep, that's it. Okay, great. I'm supposed to be looking for a way to reset a password. I hear uh -huh. all dwellers have good loot. But I suppose we can trade instead of murder. <laughs> murder. Employees only. Oh, hi. That hit me? Okay, so this is where I'm supposed to go to get the password reset. Duct tape. Uh, Harlan's up to no good. Talking crap about you again, David. This time I'm gonna record them so you can hear it yourself. A quiet movement. Yeah, not, not the best acting in the game. That's okay. Uh, let's see here. Hot plate. Uh, so here is the Pleasant Valley Network Administration Terminal. I 
shut this up. Alright, let's look at this. Welcome to Pleasant Valley Ski Resort Grand Lodge Network Administration. Pleasant Valley Intramail. Uh, okay. Regarding a community message board from 11-1686. From T. Laramie to T. Lagrin. I know you don't want to keep scrubbing the message board, but damn it, these rumors are getting out of hand. I am not seeing Davy. I wouldn't be caught dead with that halfwit. Look, Tony, I can make it worth your while. Just lock Mark out of the system for a couple of days. Hell, with all the problems we've been having lately, you can just say it's more network trouble. Okay. Intranet. Hey, Tony, I'm having trouble accessing my intramail. Could you swing by and check my terminal? Same day. Intranet's down. Hey, dipshit. Internet's broke. Fourth time this month. You think you can get it back for an entire week this time? Alex's post. I'm with Alex. You need to get your shit together, man, or someone's gonna beat it out of you. Memo. Mr. Lagrin, this morning I received a memo addressed to all you fuckers. While I recognize that the current network situation may be... may... Probably supposed to say maybe a source of considerable frustration. I do not appreciate being addressed in this manner by my subordinates. Meet me in my office in the top at 2.30. There are some things we need to discuss. Okay. So yeah, there's a lot of stuff going on here that I'm not quite following. Network administration. Mainframe status error. Internet status error. Operation status error. Error codes. Multiple system faults detected. Please contact... A Robco licensed service technician for assistance. And what do you know? We could reset user passwords right here. Oh, wow. Oh, geez. Um, please select the user to reset their password. I think we want to reset... Is it Brody? Yeah, Brody. Brody's password added. Okay, so we got a password for Brody's terminal. Now we need to find Brody's holotape. And hopefully find a bench somewhere around here so I could scrap all this stuff I'm carrying around with me. Um, so there's uh, more to explore here. So we may as well explore it. Employees only. Oh, we need an ID card. Whoa, look at this place. It's like it says checked and service. Hmm. Hmm, okay, well. Let's see if that comes into play. Uh can't go up those stairs, I get them all blocked off. Okay, this just takes us back outside. Take the snack cakes. Hmm, look at this. Steamer trunk. Quick armor piercing 10 millimeter submachine gun. Let's pick that up and take a look at it. Uh, this is level 40. Pretty interesting though. Uh, actually. Oh, what the heck? The war drum was here? That's weird. I dropped it down there. Um, man, where did I see a bench? I wish benches were marked on my compass. You know, when I got close to one, or maybe, you know, once I've discovered one, it could show up on my compass so I could remember where the heck it was so I could go back to it. That would be really nice. That would be really nice. I don't think I want to walk out there. Man, where did I see a bench? Um, hmm. Let me uh, turn off this miscellaneous quest here. Okay, so now the only quest I've got is one in this direction. 
back to uh, Brody's holotape. And hopefully while I'm over here, well, hopefully a couple things. Hopefully I'll find the bench I need. And ho also hopefully um, these enemies won't respawn. Okay, yeah, I need to go down here, right? Yeah, it's down here. Uh, nope. Here we go, here's a bench. Scrap items. And then I'm gonna go ahead and scrap uh, these things that I can't use. Okay, cool. That got me down under the limit. Just barely, though. Just barely under the limit. I need to find a stash. Oh. Plan for pocketed leather armor limbs. Don't know if I have that one yet or not. Ah, that was a new one. Cool. Um, Let's see something here. Uh, right or right leg. Standard, welded, or standard. Well, welded makes it more powerful. I was hoping I would have an option for a pocketed, you know? But I don't have that option. Chem duration. Who cares? Trapper left leg. So I could weld these things, make them stronger, but it's such a hodgepodge of stuff, I don't even know if I want to really mess with it. Shadowed metal makes it way more. I don't know why I would want to do improve stealth in dark areas. Okay. So I can't pocket any of this stuff. Uh, let's switch to uh, craft. Helmets. Hmm. I need a Saltron circuit board to make either of those. Light armor. So, combat armor chest piece. Whoa, Garb of Mysteries. Level 25. Hmm. So this thing I could make, it's level 20. I don't want to make it. And the, okay, this has a damage resist of 16. Whereas the thing I'm currently wearing this thing damage resist is 26. This thing's still way better. Let's stick with this. Okay. Um... You can pick these up huh. and just go right here and uh, recycle these because they're going to have some good stuff on them, maybe. Why not, right? Uh, let's see, do I need to um, repair any of my stuff? Alright, that'll work. Get a little bit of repairing done. Oh, a plan for light combat arms. Don't think I had that either. Okay, cool. So this is a uh, armor workbench. And this is also an armor workbench, so that's kind of dumb. Tracker, Trapper Sleek Limb Mod. Hmm, okay. Trapper Sleek Limb Mod. I mean, does that show up here anywhere? On any of these things? Do I have anything that could use this mod? Let's go to Welded. Well, actually, you know what? I, I really don't want to... I don't think I want to modify any of these. Well, again, I just looked at this. Light Armor. 
I can't even seem to make... Okay, I could make level 20 stuff. Huh. Um... Do I want to do this? Is it worth it? Is it worth crafting this armor? I really don't know. Because right now... I have level 20 of that thing. Level 15 of that. Level 20 of that. And then, uh, left leg. Oh, the left leg is Trapper. And that thing I picked up said, that mod I picked up had the word Trapper on it. Nah. I don't know. So if I craft... Craft level 20 of that. Or, I could go metal. Yeah, that's something I might do off camera. Kind of look through all that stuff and decide what it is I want to do. Because it's kind of something I have to think about. And it's probably not the most exciting thing in the world to watch. Okay, we're back in here now. We're able to get into his terminal because we have his password. A guest Brody Torrance, Pleasant Valley Intramail. Oh, geez. Uh, we've got a checkpoint massacre here on 6986. From D Thorpe to B Torrance. Let me see if I have this straight. Mac Frazier and his entire crew were wiped out by a girl dressed as a comic book character, and you, a young man I've never even heard of, managed to survive and befriend her and convince her to let you go? That is perhaps the most audacious lie I've ever heard. But very well, I'll play along. We don't have any better leads. Meet with your girl, see what she wants. But I still expect you to make your quotas. 7186 quotas. From D. Thorpe to B. Torrance. You're almost 200 caps behind this month, Mr. Torrance. Spending too much time with your new girlfriend? I must say, for all your stories, you certainly don't have much to show for it. We've lost eight more men to mysterious ambushes this week alone. Either she needs to put up or you do. 719. Deal. You can't possibly be serious. I tire of this charade. Rose will dispatch five men to Summersville to set up this ambush of yours. Hey, it's Rose. Uh, she's the one who's uh, at the top of the world, right? Um... You will join them. If your stories are true, if you do manage to kill the girl, return with her head. If not, my men will be returning with yours, one or the other. Success. Very well, you have my attention. From this point forward, your sole mission will be the elimination of this order of mysteries and their assassins. I am promoting you to lieutenant with a team of seven men of your choosing and a private suite in the Black Diamond Lodge. Continue to surprise me, and you will be handsomely rewarded. Fail, and your star will fa fall as quickly as it rose. Who talks like this? A uh, spruce knob ambush. This is almost two months later. That makes three successful hits. Judging by the reports, they put up quite the fight. It seems these are our mystery assassins. Tell your girl that I accept her offer. If she can deliver her tape, assist us in rooting out this order of mysteries, I'm willing to offer her and you anything that lies within my power to grant, once the job is finished. Of course, we know who this girl is, and we know all about this from the other side, because uh, when we very first entered Riverside Manor, or whatever it's called, um, the terminal was unlocked and we were, we were able to read it. Which is kind of a spoiler. Mother load. Excellent. I'm sending Tony over to help you analyze the database. Work with him in rows to map out your ambush plans. We'll pick them off one at a time and stay the final raid against the manor until we've thinned their numbers. Have Tony begin trawling the data for other leads, too. If their records are as extensive as you say, this could be a tremendous asset. And, uh, final. Finale? Finale? I don't know. A bit anticlimactic, but it does save us the trouble. Very well, go meet your girl. Make sure there aren't any loose ends. When you get back, report to my office in the top, and we can discuss your future with the cutthroats. 
Uh, mount holotape drive. Okay. Mounting external holotape, holotape drive done. Loading project siphon holotape. Done. Readme file found. Displaying readme file. A project siphon holotape? Continue. Here's the tape. I've loaded it with my login credentials and a full copy of the database. The mission board lists all of our operations for the next two months. That should give you plenty of potential targets. I need you to lay low for a while. Or I need to lay low for a while. Stick to the plan. I'll see you when it's time for the final operation. Tell Thorpe I expect him to keep his end of the deal, or I'll be coming for his head next. Olivia Rivers. Continue. So Olivia is um, Shannon Rivers' daughter. So that sucks. Project Siphon. Okay, why is Project Siphon on here? Holotape Contents. Project Siphon Exfiltration Program. Readme. Cryptos Database. Cryptos Login. View Cryptos Database. Oh, wow, well, we could log in from here. Error. Unknown user not found. Mistress Natasha Hunt. Oh, gosh. No missions. So, here are mission reports. Still in development. So, this is all stuff that we've already looked at. Um, before, I believe. Handbook. We already read all this. We already read all this stuff. Okay. So this is the tape that um, Olivia provided. Okay, we found his hollow tape. Mistress Olivia Rivers login added. Gain access to the headmistress's office. Well, that's what we need to do next, apparently. We've done everything that uh, we came here to do. And the quest, Seeker of Mysteries, is completed. So if we look at the quest now... Olivia Rivers betrayed her mother in the Order of Mysteries, selling them out to the Raiders. In the end, what happened to the Order? To Olivia and Shannon Rivers? With Olivia's login, I should be able to gain access to the Headmistress's office and finally get some answers. Gain access to the Headmistress's office. That's interesting. Sad too, man. Quest started the Mistress of Mystery. <clears throat> Excuse me. Learn the fate of the Order of Mysteries. Well, uh, I am thirsty. So, oh, what did I pick that up? Level 25. I, I, I probably got that as a reward, maybe? I'm not sure. But this chest piece is quite a bit better than this chest piece. So, I finally have something better to wear. Than the Trail Warden, which I've had forever. Let's take a drink here. Um, so, it's time for me to end this episode. But before I end it... Ah, oh crap. There's a Super Mutant down there. I wanted to uh, go back to the... Um, robot... And the trading robot and um, sell off this um, thing I've got if I could remember yeah that's it's in here right we go we go in jeez this place is confusing we go in here is this right I don't hear the robot though no I don't think this is the right place is it <laughs> I don't remember where the robot was, man. Um, no, this is... Yeesh. I don't think it was that way. Where there's mutants walking around. Is it this way? I don't remember. I really don't even remember at all. Uh, I think it's... I think it's in these buildings, right? Yeah, I think. 
Yeah, okay. I hear the robot. I'm out of action points. Hold on. Hold on. Wait for my action points to replenish. Um, yeah, before I end the episode, I just want to go in here and uh, sell some stuff to this guy. Problem is, it is a pain in the butt to get to him. Right? I mean, he's right there, but I have to take this roundabout way to get to him. I mean, really, really roundabout way. Go in here. And I go up. And then, uh, go down. There we go. So I'm going to, um, sell him, if he'll buy it, uh, this thing. Because I don't need any more. So this does a damage resistance of 26. This ski resort whereas this does a damage resistance of 38. And it weighs a little less, too. So let's sell this. It has no value. Pfft. What am I supposed to do with these stupid things? It has no value. I can't recycle it. Selling it gives me nothing. So, so what am I supposed to do? Just drop it on the ground? So stupid. Can't be traded. Oh, well. That was my thought, anyway. Um... So, yeah, I guess I just drop it on the ground. Thanks for your service, Trail Warden. <laughs> Alright, well, time for me to end this episode. When we come back next time, uh, we'll probably head back to Riverside Manor to gain access to the headmistress's office. Or actually, maybe we won't. Maybe what we'll do, since we'll he we're here... Oh, wait a minute. What's this now? What? Rose needs help boosting her signal before she'll trust me. The first thing to do is find some signal repeater schematics that were last seen. What? I already did all of this. I already did all of this. Are you kidding me? You have got to be kidding me. Well, I'm gonna log in. I mean, when I when I log into the game next time, hopefully this will be fixed because we already did this. Remember, I found the schematic, then I found the transponder and the duplexer. I found those twice. I assembled them at a tinker's workbench. I went to NIRA and installed it there. And I was supposed to go back and see Rose, but now this thing's all the way back to this. Man, this thing is so buggy. Well, we'll see what happens next time I log in, but, um, I mean, I don't want to be too hasty here, but I, I don't want to redo all that. I've already done it, and part of it I already did twice. I don't know. We'll see what happens next time. <laughs> so make sure you come back to see if everything works out. <laughs> Thanks for watching again, everybody. Hope to see you again in the next episode.